Welcome to my channel. In this video, I will be showing you solutions to problems related to farm machinery and mechanization. But before that, please consider subscribing and clicking the notification bell to support my channel grow. This time, we will be solving this problem. In a 200 hectare corn project, the field has to be cultivated in 30 days, what size heavy-duty offset disc harrow should be selected if the tractor to be used operates at 5 km per hour? Assume 75% field efficiency in an 8 hours working day. We begin in identifying our given. First, we have the area of 200 hectares, the number of days of 30, the operating time to be 8 hours per day. The speed of 5 km per hour, and the field efficiency of 75%. The required in the problem is the size of the harrow, symbolized by W. To solve for the size of the harrow, we will be using the formula EFC, is equal to S, multiplied to W, multiplied to E, all over 10. Wherein the EFC stands for the effective field capacity, the S is the speed in kilometers per hour, W is the width or size of the implement, and E, is the field efficiency. However, we also know that one formula to solve for effective field capacity is by getting the quotient of area all over time. Having this formula, we simply equate it to our first equation, which is the EFC is equal to S, W, E all over 10. We now have, area all over time is equal to speed times width times field efficiency, all over 10. Having this equation, we can now solve for the value of the size of the harrow which is the W in the equation, or the width of the implement. Substituting the values, we have, our area of 200 hectare, all over the time which can be solved by multiplying the number of days which is 30, to the operating time of 8 hours per day, which is now equal to, the speed of 5 kilometers per hour, times the width, times the field efficiency of 0.75, all over 10. We simply solve and we have, 200 hectares all over 240 hours, equals to 0.375 kilometers per hour, times the width. We have, 0.833 hectare per hour equals 0.375 kilometers per hour times the width. We divide both sides of the equation to 0.375 kilometers per hour. And, we have a final value for the size of the implement to be 2.22 meters. That is now the solution to our problem. If you wish to watch more tutorials related to this field, you can simply visit my channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe before you exit. Thank you for your support.